Hello everyone and welcome back to another review, or welcome if you're new here today, we'll be reviewing the season 5 premiere of This Is Us. It was almost two hours long, pretty long, but pretty great. They dealt with a lot of the different things going on in the world right now, and I think they dealt with it all very well. I was reading online, which obviously I shouldn't have done that, but some people were saying it was a little too political. I didn't really think it was political. I think it was just talking about what was happening, which I think is important to do. We can't just ignore things that are happening, especially in a show that works so hard to represent real people. And I think so many shows just have people as characters and they're not real people but in This Is Us I feel like every character is a real person and I'm glad they showed real things going on in the world right now. Now with the show itself it dealt a lot in this episode with the present day characters the relationships with the siblings are really going a little crazy I'm hoping it doesn't take too long for them to kind of solidify their relationship again. And we also got to see a little bit of Jack and Rebecca in the past as the big three, or Kevin and Kate, I should say, were being born. But then we got to see a lot of how Randall kind of came about in this world. And I really kind of did enjoy that little storyline there. I was kind of like, I don't know if we really need to see all this because I think we kind of know. But in the end, my goodness, they really got us there. Spoiler alert, if you haven't seen it, make sure you watch it. But in the end, we find out that Randall's biological mother actually didn't die from overdosing. She's actually possibly still alive. She didn't die then. But William, nobody knew that, which is crazy. That's really crazy. You know, at first I'm like, oh, this is so exciting. You know, she's alive. But then I'm thinking about it like, oh my gosh, William lived his whole life thinking that she died and they actually could have made a happily life together with Randall. But Everything happens for a reason, and I have a feeling, I mean, I'm sure she will come in to the story somehow, either in present day or something, but I'm interested to see how that works out. Then we also had Rebecca in present day, who we saw a little bit of this in earlier on in season four, where we're at the cabin at their 40th birthday and we kind of got to see a little bit of that where Rebecca is starting to lose her memory and you know it's a little interesting because they say that it's some reaction to a medication she took which is possible I guess but we'll see um but all, as usual, the acting in this episode was great, and I think there was, there was a lot going on in this episode. And a lot of episodes don't include every character. This episode included every single main character, which was crazy. And, but they had two hours to do it, so it worked out. You know, I think I'm looking forward to see how Malik and Deja's relationship kind of relates to the bigger picture because I was kind of looking for that last season. I don't really know how that all worked out, you know? I That was one thing about last season. They introduced the three characters and I feel like the only one that had a huge impact was adult Jack. I think Cassidy had a pretty significant impact with kind of getting Kevin to where he needed to be and being a friend, kind of. I hope to see Cassidy more. But Malik, we really haven't gotten to see much of how he plays in to the bigger picture of the story. And I'm sure he will. And, you know, I wonder what all of you thought of the episode. I hope you all liked it. I think it was honestly excellent. I'd give both parts an A+. Not gonna lie. It was really great. Um, 
you know, there really wasn't much I didn't like about it. I think there were some really strong moments, um, and I can't wait for the next episode. Comment down below what you thought of the season 5 premiere and let me know about any other things I should review. Thank you all so much for watching and God bless.